Yo, what's up boys, Aesthetic. In this video, we'll be going over how to set up Kovacs for Fortnite and also where to get things like routines, themes, or other information for Kovacs. So basically, I'm just gonna be going over all my settings and um, then I will show you guys some good discords as well as some other useful information you guys can use to um, either get into the game or just get some new routines or whatever you wanna do. So starting off with my settings, um, if we go over here to the main tab, Sensitivity scale is whatever game you play, for example, Fortnite. DPI, you don't have to put this in, but you can if you want. Uh, horizontal sensitivity, just put in whatever sense you play in-game. And you can uncheck this vertical lock to horizontal if that's what you play. Um, if you play like two different senses, like let's say I play three and five, which I don't know a lot of people that do, but it's just if you want to. Um, FOV scale, you want to use Overwatch. I know there's a Fortnite scale, but you don't want to use that because simulate third person because Kovacs is a first person game so 103 is like the base FOV that you want to use sometimes you can change it for certain maps but that's a whole different conversation um both of these FPS's you just want to change to whatever you use in game doesn't really matter too much and the rest of the settings just leave default for the keybinds tab I don't have anything in here changed but this right here reset session you can bind this to whatever key you want and what this will do is if you go into like any map like and you are in a challenge and you want to restart for whatever reason you can just hit that key and it'll reset the map back to just the start of a challenge so very useful and uh, yep that's all you change there for the weapons tab this is where you change a lot of things um, so starting off you want to uncheck all four of these things they will be all checked by default make sure this is set to the default one by the way not whatever gun you're using that map um zoom since multiplier doesn't matter you don't really ads in this game to be honest crosshair scale i use the small plus which is right down here it's my favorite crosshair personally i just have it white and what you want to do is you can copy my sound settings so i remove the shoot sound and I only have a sound for hit markers, and this is a actually, sorry for the Discord sound, this is actually a custom sound that I downloaded from a Discord. This won't be default. Um, I'll show the Discord later where I find all this stuff, and um, yeah, but those are just the sounds I use. The video tab, a full screen obviously, whatever your refresh rate you use, whatever resolution you use. Um, resolution scale 100, I just have all my graphics in the lowest, and I have enable plus boost for... Nvidia reflex low latency um and I use 1.8 gamma defaults 2.2 as you can see but I use it lower because I use an all black theme and I just make it just makes it look a lot better it's a little bit darker for the visuals tab I have my own custom theme which I will put a download link to in the description you can just look at a tutorial on how to import these themes uh if you want or there's also a tutorial in the um what's it called in the discords I'll show so the only thing you want to change in here besides if you want this theme are um, hide gibbs. You want to change this number to zero. And what that does is it removes the bullet holes in the wall when you're shooting like full auto weapons, which can get really annoying um, if the gun has a really fast fire rate. Uh, for the sound settings, um, not much to change here. I have my uh, headshot noise, which is crit pitched up just a tiny bit. So you can kind of just tell the difference. I mean, I don't know. I just like the way it sounds. Here, I removed the kill confirmed and spawn sound effects as well. There's just an X by them if you have one in. For the UI, um, I would just recommend copying my settings. And if you want your UI to look like this, as you can see, like this is not default where the all the things are super small and like the numbers, everything's like really small and it's in like the center of the stream. That's actually from another Discord I'll show. And they also have tutorials on how to import all of that. But Basically just copy settings for what to turn on and off. You can just pause the video and copy all of them. Um, these are just the most u the only things you need that are actually useful. And for the colors, you can just copy all of mine if you want. Um, this pink color is just the one right here, in the bottom right. And some of these I use a little bit of transparency, which would be the alpha. You can just copy all of those colors. It's just kind of some of them are default. Um, yeah, basically I just use like a black and pink kind of thing. And uh, yeah, that's about all it for the Kovac settings. Not that hard to set up once you get it. Um, there's also so many other tutorials uh, with settings as well. If you really need help on a specific topic, someone will probably go more in depth than I do. But now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you where to find things like routines as well as just general information for Kovacs. 
So starting off is what I think is the best Discord for um, just aim in general, is the Voltaic Discord. This is a really actually popular Discord, and it has so much information on just everything related to Kovacs. Um, starting off, you can just read about what basically it is. There's so many things, but the main things are the in the resources tab. So starting off, they have routines on basically every topic you can think of, weakness specific, anything you need for Kovacs. All it is is you just click it, launch it to Google tab, and it's basically just a Google Doc with routines. Like this is a share code right here. It just has routines based on specific weaknesses and things like that. There's also game specific routines. For example, uh, they have a Fortnite one. It's just not on the list. So if I would like open any of them and on the left hand side, um, when it loads, there will be a Fortnite one, as you can see. This routine is really good. I've played it multiple times. But yeah, you can just find there's so many guides, health guides, peripheral help, tools, um, guides, just anything you need if you really need. This is just the best way to get started is just reading things in this Discord. If you scroll down to almost the very bottom, you can see they have visuals. And these are the themes that you can download that are like made by Voltaic. If you want any of these, they have a tutorial right here. It's a little bit overcomplicated for no reason. I don't know why it's not simpler, but if you really want to do it, just go ahead. They have crosshairs if you want custom crosshairs. They have hit sounds that you can download that the community makes. Yeah, overall, just a really good Discord for anything Kovacs. And if you're looking for personalized routines, for example, I have routines based on my own aim. Uh, I'll put the share codes in the description. And if you don't know how to import share codes, all you do is, like, it looks something like this. You just copy it, um, like, from whoever sent it to you. You just go to the online playlist tab and just click, and it'll automatically paste it in for you. And you just click the little search bar. And I'm already subscribed, so it won't work. But that's just how you import share codes. And it'll put it in this online playlist. And then if you click this little down arrow, it'll just put it into your local playlist. I'll put all of my routines in the description if you want to play them. They're specifically for me, but I, they'll still be useful to anyone who wants to try them. The main people I would recommend to get personalized routines are Avery PvP, who has made my routines personally. I think that he's really great and he's pretty cheap. Uh, Jab Ames makes really good routines. He's a good aim coach. I recommend him. And Saint. Um, I'll have all their socials in the description. They all make great routines with different varied prices. But yeah, that's basically just a quick tutorial on how to set up Kovacs for Fortnite. Um, I didn't go that in depth, so sorry if you missed anything out. You can DM me on Twitter uh, if you have any like really specific questions. But yeah, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys later. Peace.